Yeah, it's a great day for football in this lovely stadium. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Our action today comes from the Championship in England. This looks like a really good game, Alan. I think the first 10 minutes might tell us how this match is going to pan out, who can gain the upper hand, who can get hold of this ball and ask all the questions. Can they bring the visitors into this game, the qualities that have made them the highest scoring team in the league to this point? Well, they've been full of goals and coming from all areas of the pitch too. Millwall will go like this into this fixture. So, Alan, 4-4-2? Yeah, I think it looks that way, Martin. Yes, it's the conventional shape. It's the one that the manager prefers. And this is how the visitors will line up for this match. Probably one of the two front men will slip behind the other and, and augment the midfield when required. I think so. If they start getting overloaded in the middle of the park, that's always an option for this manager who does like to fill his midfield. Made sure the pass wasn't completed. They can spread the play now, and defender can get it upfield. Well, they're trying to dispossess him. Costa. That's good passing, probing. He's a very good individual, and he's got to get it away now. At the Stoke City Stadium, there's been some significant action. A goal, in fact, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for West Bromwich Albion. Six minutes played, 1 0. Top work, Alan. We're back here now with Alan Smith. Here's a chance to go down the outside of the opposition. Well, they've got the opposition on the back foot with this break. They're coming at them with numbers. Wonderful work with the ball then. He's got some strength, hasn't he, to shield the ball like that. Difficult for the defender against the player who wants to take him on like this. Bodvarsson. A chance to break away now on the counter. Well, that counter-attack didn't work, and they might be counter-attack themselves now. The game being played in one half of the pitch at the moment. The team with possession finding it hard. Threads it through. Oh, he's in the clear here. No flag. Well, they set up to defend Allen, but they've conceded after all. Yeah, you can say that they invited that pressure, that the goal was coming. And now, really, they've got to change their attitude, haven't they? It's all about the weight of the pass here. He hardly had to break stride, and he finished it emphatically. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Here's Thompson. O'Brien. Well, winning the ball back with the interception might lead to a break for them. They're in trouble if he gives it away now. Let's check in with Alan McAnally at the Cardiff City Stadium and a goal to tell us about Alan. It's a goal for Cardiff City. 21 minutes played, 1-1. One, one. We're back here again. That's something for him to chase. Played away, well away from goal. This is the sort of side with the credentials to win the league, and they're getting themselves in a good position to do that. They are. I mean, they've not been uh, phased at all by being top. Sometimes it can affect teams' uh, 
in a in a less than positive way, but uh, they look as if they're made for that top ranking. The build-up is patient. That's the way to win the ball back. Don't want to lose the ball in this part of the pitch. Acosta. Can really get at the opposition here. And that's given away possession. Getting the ball back and thinking attack straight away. Frustrating for them, really. That was the opportunity to play on the break, but it's broken down. Acosta. Keeping the ball is one thing, but they've got to try and open up the opposition. Might just be in here from that little chip pass. Striding forward purposefully. Men in there to try to convert this cross. No real challenge to the defender from that cross. He's given it away. Well, they've gone and won the ball in the middle of the field with some high-pressure play. Bodvarsson. Saw the direction of the pass. Got to finish here. Not far away at all. Well, if they keep creating chances, I'm sure they'll take one. That was a decent effort, you know. In the Fulham game, there's news of a goal. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Swansea City. 38 minutes played. 2-1. Thank you very much, Alan. Could whip it in from here. Trying to spot a potential ball to open them up. But they're keeping the ball well. Oh, can he get it away here? To O'Brien. On the attack here. Looking to attack it in the middle. And that will clear the danger. Taking on a couple of opponents now. And the defender is there to clear it. The fourth official has indicated there will be a minimum of two minutes. And opponents around him, that's good screening of the football. Good defending, no problem in the end. Bodvarsson cut out the pass. Well, the referee has signaled for half time, and it's 1 0 here. Well, both teams have room for improvement, wouldn't you say? One goal in the first half, but just the one. No, oh, it's. It. Forty-five minutes still to go. A second half underway. Ayala. Well, oh, they couldn't keep possession. They've given it away. In the Cardiff City game, there has been a goal, and Alan McAnally can bring us right up to date. It's a second goal for Cardiff City. 
49 minutes playing. 2 1. Thanks, Alan. Excellent pressure. They should be able to build from here in midfield. A reminder for you that on EA Sports we're covering the EFL Championship fixture. Millwall, they'll be hosting Birmingham City. Good swing at it, the fist of the keeper. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Have a look at what's on now from this wide position, not closed down. Oh, he's through. They scored! Oh, it's an offside decision. Well, the players can't believe it, and neither can the crowd, but it's the right decision. Saw it coming, cut it out, good work. Lord Varsen. Well, they're getting the ball forward, they need to do that. Intercepted well. It's all happening at Fulham. News of a goal. Alan McAnally's there. It's a third goal for Fulham. 57 minutes played. 3 1. Great to have Alan McAnally out and about for us. And he's brought us right up to date again there. Transfer deal has been done. We've heard that a good vision. Needs to say cool. Brilliant goal. Oh, the crowd appreciating that and so are his teammates what a good finish and what a good ball through to him restarting at 2-0 well we're two-thirds of the way through the 90 minutes half an hour to go another turnover in play here with that interception the visitors having lots of the ball no wonder they're winning sometimes you can have the ball and not be able to do anything with it but Lovely, incisive pass. Well, that's deflected behind. It will be a corner. And here's the replay again. Well, the losing team have got to do something. And this good work from the keeper. The pressure to absorb high up the pitch. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. One-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper. He will be furious with himself for such a poor pass. It's a good press from the team that have won the ball here. Leonard. That's a great interception. They're looking to make the change now as quickly as possible, the home team. First to it is the goalkeeper. Good clearance. Ayala. Clever ball. Push back out into play. Read that well with the interception. And the interception is a vital one. Leonard. O'Brien. It's good work here in terms of possession. Can they find the final pass? Here's the chance. The ball's loose. Goalkeeper made the save. The referee went straight away, pointing to the spot. Penalty kick. Oh, was the contact? Did he dive? Love to see the replay. Was it a penalty for you, Alan? There's been no booking. It's not a, a savage offence. No, it was one of those 50-50 decisions. That
Bethany gets one look, doesn't he? And uh, he had to make the call. Oh, hats off to the keeper. Oh, brilliant stuff from him. Wasn't going to be foxed there. Well, here's the chance. The press worked. Pulls it back now. Well read by the defender. At the Stoke City Stadium, there's been some significant action. A goal, in fact, Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for West Bromwich Albion. 77 minutes played. 2-0. Thanks, Alan. Well, we'll follow that with interest. Ayala. Manager calling for the press, but he's still got the ball. Now the countdown is to 10 minutes left. He's confident. Here's a chance. He got in the way. Only partially cleared, so there's still some problems for them. He's one possession. Yeah. Left the defenders trailing now. Here's a chance. Hasn't held it, the goalkeeper. Safety first there. Well, the crowd certainly playing the part. Probing with the pass. Super reflexes from the goalkeeper. Gone in with the header, but the ball nowhere near going into the net. I think it's come off the top of his head, that one. Well, he's got away from him. Thompson. Keeper. Two minutes of added time. Ayala. Here's Ayala. It's a penalty against them two here. Well, I don't think it's going to be their day. The penalty, I think it was clear cut. And the fact that the referee's not booked anyone, is that a bit lenient? Maybe, but on the plus side, I think he's showing a bit of common sense. The penalty, I feel, is punishment enough. And puts away the penalty. Stylishly slotted in. Well, he's the man for the job. Always so reliable from 12 yards out, and he was once again. It is now an extraordinary lead, and you could say really game over. It's all over.